Well guys, the early bird nowadays is the only one that gets the worm. Let's get into today's video. I'm Zach with Blades LLC. And before we do get into the video, I'd appreciate it if you'd go down in the bottom right hand corner if you're on a cell phone, turn that phone uh, sideways so you can see it. Click on that grass seed icon and help us grow our channel. My family and I would greatly appreciate it. My little guy is actually upstairs sleeping right now. And uh, so I thought I'd come down here to the basement to make a video and uh, kind of show you guys what we're up to right now. So let's get into it. All right, so right here you can see we took the air filter and the spark plug out. We're gonna do some minor tune-ups to the BR800s. Uh, this blower, the side start, is like a little bit newer than um, the regular start here. So we have a little bit older air filter and a little bit newer air filter. So you can see the differences between those. You're not really supposed to blow these things out too much to my understanding. It can kind of um, fray these, like obviously you can do it a couple times and get stuff out of there, but these ones are due to be just replaced. So we're gonna replace those. Here we have the NGK. This is a CMR6H spark plug. So we're gonna get a hold of those. Now, to my understanding, guys, we can't get a hold of spark plugs and stuff like we used to. So it's important to plan ahead, make sure you're getting uh, parts ahead of time, like months in advance. Uh, we won't be starting lawn care here for another uh, good month or two because, well, quite frankly, we got uh, negative 10 in the forecast for this week. We should see some warmer temperatures, but no guarantees up here in Minnesota, right guys? So we're gonna move along to the trimmers now. So I've said it before and I'm going to say it again. I think making the most of your equipment this year is going to be huge. Try to avoid ordering new stuff. Now, we do have something new that I'm going to show you in Sunday's video. I hope you'll tune in for that one. It's going to be pretty cool. I got something new out sitting in my driveway and I'm looking forward to sharing it with you guys. So we're going to get into... Um, replacing and doing some tune-ups on the trimmers as well. You can see I have this one pulled apart. We are going to oil the clutch here. Oil the clutch. And replace the weather-checked primer ball. It's starting to crack. Probably do a little bit of cleanup on this. You can see the spark plug is out. And we are going to replace the air filters just like on the blowers. So this one is all pulled apart for right now. And then this one's gonna need an air filter and a spark plug, you can see. These are Bosch, I believe, are resistor 10s. Uh, that's a dirty plug right there. These things will run a lot better um, after this brief tune-up. The main purpose of this video is so that we're not waiting until the last second because things like lawnmower blades, things like oil, things like spark plugs, uh, belts, that type of stuff, you're going to probably want to order that stuff ahead of time this year, guys, right? So we need to make sure that we got at least one each or something as a backup to get you by because the dealers might not have stuff stocked up this year. So I'm just going to tell you what I'm doing, uh, give you a little bit of an overview on that and, you know, take it or leave it guys, right? Now on top of that, I've pre-ordered a pallet of pre-emergent fertilizer. That's my first application and two bottles of Mechamine D. So like five gallons, I get the two and a halfs. Pre-ordered all that stuff. So the first two applications on my fertilizing and weed control program are at least taken care of. They're gonna be there when I need them. It's just so up in the air, guys, right now with fertilizing and uh, weed control chemicals. They are all over the board, and I just would hate to see somebody uh, get themselves into some serious trouble uh, this year by not having that stuff. So 
Like I said at the beginning of the video, guys, the early bird might be the only one that gets the worm this year. It could be uh, a really tough, tough lawn care season. Well, I hope that you all took something away from today's video. I'm really hoping to do one more informational video and one um, entertainment video at least a week. So I think we're gonna do an informational video on Thursdays regularly. And I'm gonna do try well try to do more of an, an entertainment based video on Sundays. So we're gonna definitely up the YouTube game. Like I said, guys, I'd really appreciate the support. Go down in that right hand corner, click on the grass seed, help help us grow our channel. And um, other than that, yeah, I'm super excited for Sunday's video. I think you all are really going to enjoy that and you might be throwing for a little bit of a loop, who knows? Well, we're gonna leave it uh, up in the air. But if you would, uh, I've linked a video here uh, down below somewhere here. We're going to um, play the next video. I'd appreciate it if you'd tune into that and check it out. Who knows, maybe you'll learn something from that one too. And uh, until next time, guys, I'm Zach with Blades LLC, and I hope that you guys have an excellent uh, start to your lawn care season. I know you guys down south are um, just about out there, if not already. And uh, I pray that it goes uh, well for you guys. So till next time, Zach here, Blades LLC. We'll see you on the next one. God bless.